Richard Claterman was born in Paris, but has chosen to live on the French Riviera, far away from the pollution and congestion of the big city. It's in this beautiful Provençal style house where he likes to come home to his wife and son between concert tours. He has installed his white grand piano in the largest room in the house, and it's another room where he packs his suitcases for his numerous voyages throughout the world. On the days I have no professional commitments scheduled, I practice anyway, maybe a bit less, like one or two hours. Then I spend my time taking care of my family. I think about my son and spend time doing things with him, like basketball, which he adores, go shopping, run, just do simple things. If I have enough time, I like to work out, like go running, which allows me to stay in shape and be pleasantly tired. I don't have enough time to do many other things, for example, to be interested in art. I read a lot, but in the evening, in bed. The piano and my career take up a lot of time. Bonsoir, mesdames, bonsoir, mesdemoiselles, bonsoir, messieurs, Minasama Konichiwa. Je voulais vous dire combien je suis heureux de me trouver parmi vous ce soir. J'espère que vous allez passer une agréable soirée en notre compagnie. C'est la meilleure chose que je puisse vous souhaiter. Kotoshimo Daiskina ni hen ni kolalete totemo leshides. We're in Japan. This is the country where Richard Claterman has given the most concerts in the world. More than 600 performances since the beginning of his career 20 years ago. His father, a piano teacher, laid the foundation for his son's later success and began teaching him how to play at a very young age. At 23, he was additioned along with 20 other hopefuls and, to his amazement, he got the job and recorded the title Ballad pour Adeline, which was the start of what has become an outstanding success story. He has created a new romantic style through a repertoire which combines his trademark originals with classics and pop standards. Richard Claterman has clocked up massive worldwide record sales of 65 million with, at the last count, an incredible 263 gold and 63 platinum discs to his credit. This is the 20th year that I have been to Japan, and I must say that it is always a great pleasure to be welcomed by a loyal audience. Every year there are always new faces discovering my music, among them from young children to their grandparents. It is always delightful to communicate with such a wide range of fans, especially during my performances, and I hope to keep returning to Japan for many more years to come. I am surprised, which I often repeat, to see so many faithful fans who have followed me for almost 20 years. And to give you some examples of their dedication, they have started playing the piano, learning about music, and even learning French. It's great. What is the first thing you do when you get on stage? Warm up? Normally, yes. I do a few exercises. I need to practice at least four to five hours a day, especially after being on tour for one month. I need to do specific exercises for my hands in order to avoid having them become tired. I said four to five hours of practice. However, sometimes I play for five or six hours if I have a rehearsal. 
or a concert. Is this also mental preparation? Exactly, because if I don't practice before the concert, I would not be in good shape. I wouldn't feel good if I wasn't giving my best possible performance. Do you always bring your keyboard with you? Yes, this keyboard follows me everywhere. It is a great partner, and I always have it in my dressing room or at the hotel. Sometimes you also practice the piano between two concerts. Is this an absolute must? It is indispensable, and I'm unhappy if I miss a day of practice when traveling. For example, tomorrow I'm returning to Paris and I won't have time to end the day to practice. Therefore, I'll spend twice as much time practicing the next day to catch up. Please go ahead. During your rehearsals, we sometimes catch you on the big screen singing while playing. It is true that I usually sing what I'm playing. But there aren't any words. Of course not, but I need to give energy to the music, and the only way that is to sing along with the melody. I hope I don't sing too loud. But this gives me energy. This is really all about energy. And to project my energy through a piece of music, I need to sing along. Can you explain to me why you clean your piano? It's always full of dust. That bugs me. I like it when it's very clean. I have cleaned pianos around the world. In China, 70 young pianists accompanied Richard Clayderman when he played Ballet Poitiline in front of 40,000 people. And it's Xiao Rong, a young pianist from Shanghai, with whom he recorded Chinese Garden. Richard Clayderman likes to invite young pianists on stage to play in duet with them.